iPad OS 18 is finally here with a bunch of new customization features and other things under the hood. So how do you update if you want to get all this new stuff? Let's find out. A quick word of warning, if you're in the middle of a big project or have critical work to do, I suggest waiting on the update and the reasons why are in the video linked up there and in the description. But if you're ready to go, come in here and tap on your settings icon. What you want to do is go to the general settings here and go to software update. Your iPad will check to see whether the update's available, and there it is. Now, I've been on the iPad OS 18 development beta, but you may not see that one there. All you need to do now is choose to update either later or right now. Let's hit the update now button and go for it. You'll need to enter your passcode and agree to the terms and conditions. At this stage, the update will be requested, and eventually, once you find your place in the queue, it will start downloading and then be ready to update. And there it goes, about 10 minutes left to download load, we'll use the power of editing to jump into the future. So you can see here now that the download has completed. It's now preparing that update. Once this is ready, we'll be ready to install. So as you can see, it's now at the part of the process where it's installing the new update, and this will take a while. And here we go. It is now updated to iPad OS 18.0. And we can now go ahead and utilize the new features. If we tap and hold, we can come in here, we can edit and uh, edit the pages, customize, add widgets, change the icons to small and large, all the things that we can do here in iPad OS 18. And if you'd like to get a complete overview of some of the cool options, check out the other videos in the description.